popped into countdown for a few essentials before lockdown. Lemon meringue pie, apricot, whipped cream, dash of raspberry jam. Absolutely bloody marvellous. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, pie. I hope you've had a bloody marvellous day. We heard late afternoon that there was a possibility of a lockdown due to there being a case of the in the community of COVID. I was always planning to go to a Countdown sometime this week to try out the app. However, I thought now would be a good opportunity, so off I went just to get a few uh, bits and bobs uh, that I needed. There was a sunny start to the day and a good run in to town. Uh, a little late, but I got in or just before 8 for a class starting at 8, which uh, was not uh, very well attended. But yeah, those that were there got the full benefit of my knowledge. And then it was an hour's break. And I think I had a cup of tea or something with the uh, in the tea room or the smoke over room, and then another two hour class which was uh, pretty full on and busy. Yeah, the uh, that one, and uh, then it was afternoon time where I popped down for a, a wee bit of lunch. I think I had a uh, date scone today or date and orange scone, which was very nice. And then uh, the rest of the afternoon went in various um, activities. Uh, with the students and colleagues uh, just uh, getting stuff done. And uh, then I found myself at four o'clock and there was word that there was likely to be a lockdown. So I thought, well, I'll pop over to Countdown and uh, get a few things on the way. As I was going into Countdown, I texted my lovely wife and said, uh, you know, is there anything you need? And our daughter Kelly's up. Uh, from the South Island so she said she wanted a sweet treat so I got my little bits and bobs of stuff and I bought a lemon meringue pie some whipping cream and I knew I had a tin of apricots in the cupboard at home that was near there um, possibly you know been there a while so I thought oh, I'll get get rid of those and so there it is I bought it all home and uh we had a lovely, a sweet treat with um, uh, daughter Kelly and my wife and I, and there's, there's still a little bit left over. Those lemon meringue pies are bloody marvellous. Three, six, eight, three steps. Some essentials. Four hours of class, four hours of men, 85.5 kegs. What is the Pritzker Prize awarded for in which field? Answers in the comments below the video. First in with the answer to yesterday's question about the Pirate Island was Howie Jones with his answer, the Coco Islands. Agreed to by David from Desmond Stonders and Moz, uh, Howie takes his place on the Hall of Fame with his Inside knowledge of the island and his uh, possibility of extreme wealth when um, he buys some batteries for his metal detector and gets out there and finds that elusive pirate's gold that everyone knows is there but nobody has been able to find. I have every faith in Howie. Bloody marvellous. Cheers. Feel legit. This has been a Mario presentation. Recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, capital of the Waikato district, a district towards the top of the North Island of Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud. We're a little country right at the bottom of the globe, a place where Kiwis live in a paradise we like to call God's own country.